Sophie de Loon. I'm Chris. And I'm Wesley. My excellent loon. <laughs> yes, I am your excellent. You was very excellent, I tell you that. That is just funny, isn't that? Pick yourself off the floor from laughing so hard at that humor. Oh, Today Lord. we are doing something breakfasty. Yes. We're doing something that's exciting for the holidays, even though if you're watching this and it's 2020, it's a weird thing, yes. but we're going to celebrate anyway with our own yes. little nucleus families. Let's tell them what we're doing. We're <laughs> doing our sheet pan, pan Mexican, Mexican friend. Tata. Get it? Eggy? Excellent? <laughs> I know. That's yeah. a mouthful, but it feeds. So, okay, I've got to tell you this right now. I, we do not want to encourage big giant crowds no. in 2020. We just, that's not safe. Right. Um, so this makes enough to feed a nice crowd. So when, you know, later on, when we're all healthy and if things are safe and we can all gather, this is great. In the meantime, I'm sorry, this is enough for leftovers. <laughs> and then for us. It, yes. is, it makes great leftovers, and maybe you have a large family. It, it feeds it's probably 12 people. It's so good, and it's perfect for that holiday morning. I know. It's so great. I know, I know. You can, you can actually put it together the night before if you wanted to. You can, you can. I'll talk about that in a moment. Oh, so anyway. okay, excuse me. <laughs> yeah, okay, so but <laughs> let's talk about who we're partnering yes. with. Yes. You've probably seen uh, some of the dishes that we've done with our dear, dear friends, Ozo. Ozo, these plant. guys are so wonderful. It is just, I mean, they have revolutionized plant-based um, cooking. Yes. And I tell you, it's just incredible. It's their, they, we've talked about it, they, they, they talk about the flexitarian diet. It's, it's brilliant. Perfect. It's the, we're moving towards that new year when we all need to be thinking about, <laughs> you know. And so yes. we don't have to go off the cliff. We always yeah. do that. We're like, we're gonna lose 100 yeah. pounds in a month. And then I'm starving by lunch. In a week, we're like, well, <laughs> forget that. So anyway, this is a way that you can just be a little more moderate yeah. in your diet. Take out your meat. Take the meat and you don't have to sacrifice no. on taste that's it's, what's so incredible it is so good it's a pea protein that just it tastes exactly like a ground beef it's really yeah. phenomenal so we did california burgers with their burgers we did a vegetarian pasta bake yes. with their ground protein and then, and then we, we did, did the acorn squash. stuffed acorn oh, squash so that was good. incredible very uh chris uh thanksgiving, thanksgiving. and then today we are using their mexican um seasoned yes, ground it, it is, is yeah. just phenomenal it's so really really good. good it's already got mexican seasoned needs already uh, built into it so you don't really have to do anything but just like heat but we're up. gonna jack it up a little bit well, of course that's what we do okay <laughs> all right let's so, come on let's get out is there anything i was oh, wait, and you can get you can order their uh their ozo foods at ozofoods.com yes and i'll remind you at the end of this you certainly will okay so now let me tell okay so now we talked your ears off so let's get going making this wonderful let's frittata. do it okay so we uh, we're gonna build this with uh, some really incredible flavors i've got a nice uh, medium or a large skillet that i put a couple of tablespoons spoons of unsalted butter mm -hmm. let that melt and then I just put a cup of chopped onions and then a cup of this little guy right here which is called a poblano pepper yeah that I just cut it I cut him open I took out the seeds and I finally diced him if you don't have access to the, these are found in the produce section of most well-stocked yes. supermarkets if you can't find them you could certainly use um, jalapenos are gonna these are mild I should tell you yeah, don't do that. <laughs> they're, they're not overly spicy at all. But if uh, so, but no. you could use something like a serrano or a jalapeno. But that's going to give you a lot more right. heat. Keep that going. I know. Don't I know. be burning that. I'm not. <laughs> and so anyway, or you could use a, a bell, a green bell pepper, and that's going to give you no heat right. either. Okay. So now what I did, I, I cooked that for about five minutes until it uh, got, nice got nice and, and soft and translucent. And translucent. Is yes. What you always say. It's, it's what, well, <laughs> it's an accurate term. It I'm is. sorry. Okay. It so is. now we're just going to add this amazing ozo into the um, into the mix here. So good. And like I said, it's got these built-in seasonings that you don't really have to do anything. Now, obviously, this this uh, dish that we're making is so loaded with flavor and so good. Yes. You could, if you just absolutely insisted on using, you could use yeah. breakfast sausage, you could use sure. chorizo, but folks. Hey, be a little flexible. Get a, be flexitarian. You will not <laughs> regret it, I'm telling you. All so, right, so while that's cooking, we're going to make the egg batter that goes, that mixes in with all that. So let me just say food. something real quick. I'm sorry. <laughs> you have to let this thaw first, and the way I, we recommend doing it is let for thaw for just 20, just put it in the refrigerator. It stays in the freezer 
24 hours before you want to use it, just stick it in the fridge and it'll thaw perfectly. Perfect. Okay. And then this only cooks for like four minutes okay. and it's ready. Yes. I've All talked right. enough. Okay, go. <laughs> Let's talk about the eggs. I've got 18 eggs in this. 18? <laughs> yes, it's crazy. But you need enough to fill that sheet pan. I know, that seems like a ridiculous right. amount. And it is, but we're feeding... I don't think people can see this sheet pan. Here's this giant sheet pan. Yeah. What is this, 11 by That's a That is an 11 by 17, which is what we recommend got for it. this, okay? All right, so I've got 18 eggs in here, and then I've got some hot sauce. <laughs> and that is, uh, what, a tablespoon? No, that yeah, that's, uh, yeah, that is a tablespoon. Okay, thank just you whatever go. your favorite kind of hot sauce I is. I love it. Just to give it just a little bit of that Mexican mm -hmm. flair to it. And then Not a lot of heat. Then some cilantro. Mm. Oh, I love it. I love it. How much cilantro is that about? That a is a quarter spoon? cup. A quarter cup. Okay. That's fresh cilantro that's chopped. Yes. And then we have some salt and pepper, just a uh, half a teaspoon. And then a, a freshly ground black pepper. Yep. Yeah. And then a teaspoon. <laughs> you can't just let me be. Sorry. <laughs> and then a teaspoon of salt. <laughs> that's exactly what it is. <laughs> and a cup of cheese. A cup and a half. Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> it's a cup and a half of, we love using a combination of Monterey Jack and cheddar cheese. Um, and you can often find that combination in many supermarkets that are already shredded for you. Yes. And uh, but really, I like those big chunky shreds. I do too. I like a <laughs> chunky shred myself. Okay. How's that coming along? It's coming right along. So what That's I'm going to do is I, this is beautifully cooked now. So it, doesn't that look so good? And the smell is off the charts. Yeah. And I think I have this. Well, I got a couple there. That yeah. I just keep on going. So now we're going <clears> to, <throat> we're really going to add more beautiful, beautiful color oh, and yay, flavor to this. About so that. now what I'm going to do is I've got a cup of of corn. You know, if you're doing this during the holidays, it's a great breakfast time, holiday time uh, breakfast. It's kind of hard to find the fresh, so I love to go with the frozen corn. Yeah. Um, it's fro flash frozen right at the peak of its season. You could do canned, that's uh, of course, but I do a cup of that. And then these are just some black beans. I got another cup of that that I got from a can that I rinsed. And then I'm just gonna mix. Isn't that look amazing? Yeah, that, looks that is glorious. Amazing. So, all right, are you all? I'm ready for you. I'm ready. Okay. All right. We are just plowing through this. <laughs> so now this is when it's so cool. You guys, you're not gonna believe this, and it comes together. Don't so, be flinging beans. Hey, I, you know, I get excited <laughs> and I fling beans. I can't help it. Okay. It's you, a problem you've had since. I childhood. have. I'm a bean flinger. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now Wesley wanted to do this just like from start to finish. Yeah, look at that. So I'm, I'm trying not to waste anyone's oh, time. Oh, it's all right. It's I'm, Christmas time. Take that's time. true. We can all t tell <laughs> stories, and exactly. since we can't all be together, Aww. we might as well. Okay, now you, so we just, we. oh, I should have said, I didn't see you're plowing me through this. So <laughs> yes, you need right. to make sure that you grease your, your pan before you do this. I... You know, it's the holiday, so I do a little butter. Do a couple <laughs> tablespoons of, of just rub some butter there. If not, you can certainly use kitchen uh, so cooking good. spray. That's no problem. So just, I'm going to even this out so everybody gets a, some, some of this lovely Yeah, just ozone. even that on out. Yes. All right. It takes the line forever to do this. So, okay. <laughs> I've evened it out. You're okay. so even. Move okay. it or lose it. Okay. <laughs> what I have to put up with. <laughs> All right, here okay, so now this this is where you're gonna think, is it gonna all fit in there? And it does. Um, oh, sorry, okay. All okay. right, I'm just gonna pour this over. Now, if you don't have one of these big old uh, measuring cups, that's a 10 cupper, um, then what I often have done before is I, I'll just sort of ladle it out in a big bowl. Uh, but that's, you're doing well, Loon, that's good. Thank you. <laughs> it's like you've done this before. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so that's good. And Hold see on. all that cheese just, oh, yeah. it's so beautiful. And get Good. the extra cheese over there, too. Yeah, oh, we will. We, you know, you know us. We got to be cheesy. Yes, of course. Okay. Okay, Wonderful. so look at that. that it just filled great. that beautifully. And don't worry, it's going to just cook and be perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we some you, cheese on top. So, we got another, so that was a cup and a half of cheese. Now we got another cup, or no, I'm sorry, another half a cup of cheese that we're going to top this with. Oh, oh that I'm looks so great. excited. And the really brilliant thing about this is it only bakes for like 12 to 15 minutes. Yeah. So and basically then, we, what we've just, just done from start to finish is what you get, right? <laughs> <laughs> I, I would think so. Okay, so I've got my oven heated to, preheated to a uh, screeching hot 450 degrees, and then we're gonna put it in there for, like I said, anywhere from 10 to 12, 15, no, more like 12 to 15 minutes till those eggs set. And then it's ready to eat. You're just gonna do a little bit of, you know, garnishes and Yay. everyone's gonna be so happy. Yay! All right, here we go. Put her in there. 
Okay, yay, that's Ready. so easy in the smell. Yes. Oh my gosh. It smells, del oh, oh, that look looks that. great. That. <gasps> Absolutely gorgeous. That is a tray of delicioso. Oh. <laughs> Look at that. I mean, okay, so by now you would have hopefully called the kids down. Hopefully you and your spouse would have had time for a mimosa or two, you know, because this is reason to celebrate. Isn't that beautiful? That is gorgeous. That is so gorgeous. It's yeah. so beautiful. So okay. what was it, 15 minutes, 12 minutes? I did it for like 14 minutes and it just cooked it perfectly. So, right. we've, so we love serving this with some fun um, add-ons. Yes. Um, I've got some of my homemade pico de gallo here that's so easy to make. I Go got ahead, the recipe. start throwing that All right, stuff. I'm going to just okay. sprinkle this on. And, um, and it's I've all got, about the accoutrements. I've got some... Some avocado, which we just love. Yes, some fresh avocado is mm, heavenly. Yes, just throw it in there anywhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, um, these folks, these are, these all these are right here are corn tortillas, yellow corn tortillas. I heated up a little uh, oil and I just deep fried them for a few minutes until they got super crispy. They're so delicious and so easy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at that. This is about as festive as it I'm gonna save a couple of avocados for my. That's a good idea. <laughs> okay, and then we got Thanks. some. <laughs> sure. And then I've got some fresh cilantro here. And ladies and gentlemen, that look at that. That's wonderful. Okay, you do the you do the honors. You got it. Oh, okay. We're going over here. Yeah. Okay. So this may, like I said, this really oh, divides we're going up. Over here. <laughs> okay, sorry. sorry. I don't know why we're. <laughs> Hi. So. Um, I wanted to be close to you. Oh, oh that's I crunched. sweet. It's like Christmas morning. Um, so. <laughs> This really comfortably feeds 12 people, or in our house, two. Stop. Um, no, I know. Two for two days. Okay, we're just gonna, so we're not gonna go to the whole effort of. of no. I don't, still don't know why you did this all the way over here, but okay. You want me to dig this out? <laughs> because that's why it was put on this planet to, to annoy you. You don't <laughs> annoy me. Look at that. It's just like, look at the frittata. Oh, let me have that one. Okay. Oh, yeah, here. You take that. And you see the the ozo, the ground, uh, the Mexican ground in there. It's just you guys. And the corn and the black bean. Look. Okay, hold on. I gotta just do this. A couple of. I gotta do a couple of these. A little guys. more avocado. Yeah, yeah. The avocado is just. The, it all goes okay, together. Okay, there you go. Wait, and. And this is okay. So I've got my homemade salsa. This is so easy, and I've got the uh, the link to the recipe for that in the recipe as well. So good. Just put it on there. I'm just. <laughs> Well, I'm trying to create a nice picture. That's what I do. Oh, okay. Instead of you, slop, slop, slop. Well, <laughs> people want to turn off their phones and go start making this, this frittata. All right, look. That is, that a, is that gorgeous. Is a work of beauty. Oh, wait, guys, should you do this? That? Oh, I have one there already. Oh, that's okay, more. Okay. <laughs> Y'all, can you see that? <gasps> and look it at that. Smells look at so the, good. The, oh, everything's mixed together so nicely in that. All right. I'm just gonna it really it. is the fe it's the most for the holidays. Hopefully, I don't burn my mouth. Well, it wouldn't be the first time. You develop calluses. <laughs> oh wow! You see how it perfectly sat, and that was 14 minutes. It's a it's a flavor. wow! That is so good. <laughs> it's a powerhouse. It packs a punch of flavor. I love that. And it looks like the holidays. It's it's so festive. You guys, I mean, talk about kicking off the. I mean, you know, the morning of. Unbelievable! Oh my. Uh, Stars. Yeah, and garters. <laughs> what? All right, one more little bite. Oh, a little bite. Talk a little bit. Just talk, just very briefly about the the ozo, the ground. Mmm. Mmm. Wouldn't you think that there's breakfast sausage or mm -hmm, or mm -hmm. seasoned mm -hmm. meat in there? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. I would have no idea, no idea that that is a plant-based protein. And believe me, if anyone would know, it's I, this one. I would. And it's seasoned so perfectly. I know, I know. A little Mexican flair. I love it. I love this. Oh, well, thank you, Ozo. Oh, hold on. Sorry. <laughs> this is 100% Luna Prim. Oh, it's so good. We should Thank leave you. some oh, leave no. some of this out for Santa. He I would, know. I he love would this. never leave. I love this. So if you want to order your own Ozo Foods, go to ozofoods.com. They've got, like you said, they've got the, the hamburger patties. They've got just the ground beef. They've got the Mexican ground. It's so good, you guys. 
That's be amazing. Be a little flexible in your new year. <laughs> That's right. We all got to be wow. a little flexible these days. Now you can get this recipe on howtofeedaloon.com. Isn't that great? I'm just, I'm ecstatic. I'm, I feel like I want to go open presents or something. <laughs> Anyway, but I'm just going to sit here and eat my frittata. Yes. it's Go to our social media, like us, share us, spread the word of mm. love, at least amongst your family. Mm. Call the people you love. Let's all reach out to each other virtually and know that next year, everyone's coming over to our house. Yes. And we are making the feast to end all feasts. Yes. Oh, wow. It is so good. And we're starting off with this. I love it. I Yay. love it. Merry Christmas, everybody. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Feliz Navidad. Happy Kwanzaa. Everything. Yay. Happy, Happy healthy. Ramadan. Yes. Happy I healthy living. Yes. <laughs> Bye, all. Bye, y'all. <laughs> Hey everybody! Hi guys! Now if you want to be a part of the Loon Fun, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. And don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you won't miss a single recipe. That's right! Oh, and speaking of recipes, if you want another amazing recipe yeah. like this, then just click right here! Yeah, click! Click! Subscribe! It's so much fun! <laughs>